So we have just arrived in St. Thomas, U.S. Virgin Islands on the Sea of Getaway, and we are disembarking right now. We are docking in St. Thomas, right next to the MSC, and it's more insanity. It's parallel parking. It. Yeah. As a driver, and somebody likes to drive a lot of vehicles. This dude just parallel parked this ship right behind Seashore, which is one of the cruises I was actually looking at going on. And maybe we'll have to go there sometime soon. And no, I'm not one of those guys that's gotta hurry up and be the first one off the ship. I could care less. When I get off, we can go have a ball. Because this is St. Thomas. And one detour is I did bring my Sony camera down here to shoot some pictures of this island. I didn't bring a battery charger and all the batteries are dead. This is our second stop. Next we go to Puerto Rico, and then we're going to the Dominican Republic. And I do have a lot of exciting stuff to do at Dominican Republic. Puerto Rico, we're just gonna be walking around and see what we can find. Uh, we're officially off the boat and in St. Thomas. Let the madness start. First thing up, get away from the crowds, get a like a little bit away from these buses because these guys are just herding cats. And if you care, these are the shops Basically walk off the boat 100 yards away of that. And we're playing in the middle of July and it's like 87 degrees, beautiful breeze. It's kind of nice. And for all the people that are worried about getting lost, look, you can't miss the ship. You can see it from wherever you're at. Life is easy in the Caribbean. Hell, life is easy everywhere. No stress. And a five minute walk gets you to St. Thomas Skyride. So, uh, $24.95, ride to the top. So I know I like to get high, not like that, put an advantage point and get really cool pictures and shots. So that's the whole reason I'm doing this. Detours with Jeff is my channel. Detours with Jeff, we'll remember that. Where are you from, man? Where you from? Indianapolis. Detours with Jeff, let's do it. We are on top. From Paradise Point in the Caribbean. Never been here before, so this is a new place for me. And that's our cruise ship down there with the MSC Seashore. And boy, they set you up good, right? You know, put a bar right at the top, just so you can grab a beer and look at these scenes. And I think I might just do that. Slide up to the bar, and I think we're gonna do, in honor of my mom, they got a bushwhacker with Baileys in it. We're gonna try that. Just a bushwhacker. Whew. It's cold. Cheers to you. So of course, you grab a drink, ask the bartender where to go, and then tell you. Tell you what, twenty-five dollars, a little bit much, but it's so worth it to get the shots and get the view and just be up here for a few minutes. The breeze is amazing up top. Time lapse of the ride down. Yeah, let's do that. Got to take pictures of a whole lot of people. It's kind of a fun thing. They see me with the camera and everybody is like, oh, "Sir, can you take it?" Yeah, absolutely. Give me that phone. And then it, it's so much fun at the end when somebody says, wow, that's actually a really good shot. And I want to tell them, you know, I hope so. I've been practicing for 15 years. Okay. Thank you. Have a good day. Have a good day. Let's go see if we can find a beach. Maybe Megan's Bay. All right, first of all, we have to talk about this ride because this guy was riding in a passenger van and we had about 12 people in it. And my boy was driving like a NASCAR 500 guy. And I think we went up to about a thousand feet. By the way, we're in the wrong, in the other lane. So everything's reversed here. And my boy flew up and over and down and through and went through parking lots and people's driveways and whatever he had to do to get us here. And we got here in about 13 minutes. It was a very exhilarating 13 minutes of going completely uphill and downhill and it was hilariously funny but everybody got very quiet on the bus. 
But nevertheless, we survived. There we had Megan's Bay. Now this is on the exact opposite side of the island. It's supposed to be one of the top 10 voted beaches in the world. We're gonna find out right now, but then I don't know what a top 10 beach would look like. So apparently there's some reefs and other things and a restaurant and a bar. <laughs> Ooh, there's a bar everywhere. Really, you could have signed your name better. Oh, hey. <laughs> about, I don't know, five minute walk, six minute walk. I'm kind of towards the end of it now. So we're gonna jump in here and see if I can see anything on the water. I've been around enough to know what I'm missing. But I dream of something more. And I might be down to help them fight for a mission. If I knew what all the fighting was for. Cause you got an endless list to twist when things aren't going your way. You got them convinced the facts are fiction, different spin every day. I'm not gonna tell you what you're missing. You were to listen anyway. But now that I'm here, I've got something to say. This is the last chance to tell you that I'm not coming back. It's the last chance to prove. Get a chance, don't miss Maker's Base in St. Thomas. Look at this place. Pretty amazing. Oh my god, yes, the $8 cab ride to Maker's Bay is so worth it. Don't worry about tours, don't worry about any of that out of the junk. When you walk off, just jump a cab, say I want to go to Megan. This island's set up for tourists. It's set up for you to get around to where you want to be, but it makes for a hell of an eight-hour stop on a cruise ship. Now if only a lizard would come running out behind me right now. And yes, it worked out buying these fishing shoes from Academy for 30 bucks. I didn't know Magellan made fishing shoes, but wow, they're comfortable and they work great. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I went to like nine stores walking around a while ago before I went to Megan's Bay. And I had seen this really cool shirt. All they had is smalls, extra larges, three X's. Can't fit them that, I can fit medium or large. So I walked in, last store getting back from all of it, right across the street from the ship. You're gonna see it. Don't worry, I'm gonna wear that stuff. Look these people! <laughs> oh look, camera on camera action. So this was St. Thomas, hope you enjoyed it. We have two more stops, Puerto Rico and Dominican Republic. So that's gonna be awesome. I have some big plans, Dominican Republic. Look, if you like going crazy and doing a bunch of wild shit, Hit that subscribe. But this is St. Thomas. It's been a blast. Time to go back this year.